Hey everyone, SerpentW3 here, and welcome to the story of Henry Bishop, a indie horror game available on Steam. So, it has mostly positive reviews, I haven't looked too much into it, all I know is it's classified as a horror, psychological thriller, so let's get into it. <laughs> I have no save game, just proving I haven't played this. Flashlight right off the go. Alright, was to move, tab, open inventory, flashlight F, E to interact and shift to run. Alright. Many wardrobes have strange symbols. It seems to me that I've been something like this before. I've seen something like this before. These symbols seem to keep these creatures out. The only place where I can have a sleep is these damn wardrobes. I can't figure out how to get out of this place. The only food I can find here is these rats which swarm like wasps around my wounded body. They are waiting for me to breathe my last breath so that so that they could fill their little stomachs with my flesh. Looks like a diary page. Can I hide in it? I can. The ground phone lags the tone arm. Yes, that. Um, hello? <laughs> Boy, how did you get to this place? Hey! <laughs> he is not normal. Boy? Oh. <sighs> Where'd he go? Sometimes they come back. Kalungu. Ah, the locker is locked. <laughs> Funny that, a locked locker. Teddy bear, it's pretty well worn. Can't take it. It's missing an eye. Any reason why I can close this? Alright, I'm assuming I'm going to have to be hiding in those. Alright, so I need something... Oh, Jesus. I need something to open that locker, and I need a gramophone tone arm. Hello, mister. Okay. Vision suddenly went blurry. Oh, I can hear something. Oh. <laughs> Is that the rats? That's, that's a big purple rat. At least the rocking horse has stopped. Oh, hello! <laughs> Someone's collecting. Gold key. Can't open that one. Ah, the locker is locked. Radio receiver made in the USSR. Oh, wait. No, okay, I can't actually examine.
Hey, turn arm. Oh god, what a face. Joshua Peterson, 12 years old. On 27 September, he left home and up to the present moment, his whereabouts are unknown. Anyone who can report any information, please call the number 363-5050. Alright, I'll take it. Oh, okay. Ah! I'm clicking! I'm clicking! I'm clicking! I need to hide. This creature haunts me. I'm gonna try and go as far as possible and hide. He doesn't know I'm here. Alright, I probably ran way further than I needed to. Ground phone lags the tone arm. Didn't I hurt? I grabbed the, the tone arm. Ground phone lags the tone arm. The ground phone lags the tone arm. Yes, the ground phone. Gramophone torn arm. Oh, what? No, what are you doing here? That's not fair. Come back to. Come back down here. Gramophone, gramophone, torn arm. Gramophone, gramophone. Gramophone, 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 gramophone. Golden key. Oh, I can get weapons. Gramophone, torn arm. Oh, I'm only at 40 HP. Well, how do I use? It's in my inventory. No, Josh. Go away. I wish there was a peak mechanic because I have no idea if he's past me or not. Okay, no. He hasn't. Wait a few more seconds, he should be walking down further that way. Or not? Where is you, boy? Oh, come on!
Ah, oh, there's two sides. Oh, hello! use my items yeah come on just show me I guess So I can. Ew. How do I use objects? Okay, nothing there. I'm going to turn this down just a little bit. Can never wish me. There is no record here. Oh, fuck you. Ah, the locker is locked. All right. Starting to open things. Hey, record. Yoink. Oh my god. This door. No! What are you doing? Leave! Too slow. Ah, let me in. Yeah, that's right. Walk away. I saw you. My name is Henry Bishop, and I will tell you my horrible story. This story happened to me in the late 70s, and even the most terrible nightmare will seem only echoes of horror in comparison with those mysterious events which I participated in. I worked as a real estate agent, and we had an old mansion in the main which no one could sell. No one it was could a dead sell. weight in our company. As a stale product on the store shelf, which was losing its value every day. After all, houses also have a shelf life. And then, one May morning, the silence of our office on the Fifth Avenue was broken by a telephone call. That call changed my whole life. It was a Mr. Johnson, a very strange client, who was willing to seize this old junk called house. And even the fact that a family of five people disappeared in this house did not frighten him. But on the contrary, it was the reason for such a strange purchase. 
After a brief conversation, my boss decided to send me to Stonebridge, to this provincial hall in Maine. My task was to inspect the house and make sure that it still didn't fall apart, and then to contact the client for a deal. My name is Henry Bishop. I will tell you my horrible story. Yeah, give it a smack. Alright, that intro took a little bit too long for me to do. Dear Mr. Bishop, the wiring in old houses is not reliable, so I reassured and turned off the electricity. All you need is to find a switchboard and follow my instructions. Three starlings flew toward the light. The first below, the second above, and the third in the middle. Darkness comes where the light is turned on. Electrician Stewart. I wonder who this Stewart is. Yes, and he's very there is no good light at riddles. In the house. I need to find the switchboard. Switchboard. Door is locked. The key might be in the house. Okay, you're not going to say anything about that? Hello. Ma'am, what are you doing here? It is a private property. He locked me. Locked me up in this chest. Who locked you up? My master. It's all his fault. Master, I will find the key and set you free. And then I will take you to the sheriff. Switchboard. Okay. Uh, three starlings flew around, flew toward the light. The first below, the second above, and the third in the middle. Low above middle. Low above middle? It seems to start working. Yeah. Got anything to say about that? Convenient. Yeah, it doesn't look like the lights are on. Alright. I wonder if she's the mistress of the house. Jammed. I need to pry it with something. Alright. What's that photo of? Oh god. Closing behind me. What is it? Oh, Olympic statue? Oh, we got a note. Oh, news. Body has been found in Fur Lake. Fisherman Billy's body has been found today in the morning near Fur Lake. According to preliminary information, Billy was strangled, then his body was thrown into water. 
The sheriff rejected to comment on this brutal murder, stating that the perpetrator would certainly be found and get the punishment he deserved. We all mourn for Billy. To some people, he was just an acquaintance. To the other, he was a friend. Anyway, he did not deserve such a terrible fate. There have never been such tragic events in our small town before. In this hard time, we... Dot, dot, dot. Ah, it's the door. Lovely collection. Little key. Seven-year-old Alicia Nelson became the victim of the fire. The tragedy happened on September 5th at 12.30pm. According to the preliminary data, a fire in the Nelson house broke out as a result of a children prank. A game with fire took the life of seven-year-old Alicia Nelson. Her 10-year-old brother Robert got minor burns and was taken to St. Edmundo Hospital. Looks like some kind of ritual staff. Three exclamation points. Oh, I can't take it. Damn, it's worth a try. Okay, knife under the pillow. The chest is locked. The chest is locked, okay. Little key? Little lock. Maid's diary. Oh god, okay, we're in for a story. Well, that explains the knife. Holy Bible. Old Bible, but apparently it hasn't been read much. Nothing. This is where Harry Potter sleeps. Is the one I had to pry open. Is this one? Yes. Could use the knife as self defense. Hello. Oh. Hello. Would you like a plunger? Are you going to go away? I'll give you a seizure. Old plunger. I can't use it. Okay. Back! Oh, the clock stopped. Where is ya? Oh, I didn't even check upstairs. Is that a house key? The house key. Oh, yep, thank you. Alright, so I'll have to use the plunger for something upstairs. Yeah, I haven't found a code or anything. Unless it was in the diary somehow. All these doors are different. Well, some of them are different. Alright, plunger. Is that a shuriken? It's 
star. I doubt it belongs to a samurai. You don't know. What's telling me? Is it the door? It's just telling me when I look at random objects. Oh, Jesus. I'm sorry, did you like... Do I just go? No! The door! I can't get out the door! We got to get out of here. We? Who's we? You suck! Ah! What? Holy, what? My car! What the hell is going on? Henry, are you tripping? I can't go away. That awful creature is wandering somewhere there in the woods. Somewhere? You can see it from a mile away. Excuse me, ma'am, do you have anything to say about all this? Nothing added, <laughs> so I have to go back into the house now. Gobs there is gone. Sorry, I turned off your music. Toy locomotive, but now I'm definitely not up to games. Yeah. Is this a code? <laughs> Drawing of Henley, but who is standing near? Okay, I don't want to take it, but I guess I'll have to. Daddy. The chest is locked. The chest is locked. Alright, there's a teddy bear. Okay. <laughs> yeah, thanks. I'll, I'll keep that drawing. Oh my god. These bloody doors, they're gonna get me killed. How much health? I'm at 50% health. They almost got me killed before. This is... Similar layout to before. It's... They did not pay for the telephone for a long time. It does not work. Okay. A shovel. Okay. Am I going to dig my way out? Radio receiver. It does not work. That is a loud clock. I can hear it through the ground. Through the floor. There is no record here. There is no record here. Okay. Is this guy going to be in here again? Doll seems to be watching me with one eye. 
Yeah. Okay. So, what do I actually have? A shovel, so I'm assuming I need to go back outside now with this shovel. I don't think those blocks actually were the combination. I mean, save it. I know two, two, three, four, one. I doubt it. Two. Three, four, one. Nope. Didn't think so. Oh well. Worth trying, um, maybe. All it cost was time. Alright. Shovel, shovel. What can I dig up? A shower. A house key. A shower. A what? A shower. A what? A shower. Oh. Apparently I'm carrying a shower. Where can I dig? No markings. There's no markings about where I should be digging. That's if even that's a shower. Even if Star. I'm meant to. I doubt it belonged to a samurai. Um No. I mean, this is the only thing that's here. And a shower. Nope. So I have a shuriken, a shovel, and a house key. Nothing new going on in there. There's nothing in here, yeah. Oh. D okay, I'm guessing a dig here then? A shower. No? Okay. That's deep. A shower, a shower, a shower. Like the house key. Let me run into it. So Hold deep. But I can't use the shovel. Um I 
can't interact with anything. Star. Nope. I doubt it belonged to a samurai. I am a little bit stuck. I, I'm not too sure what I'm meant to be doing. I have a shovel, but or a sh I have a shower, um, but it can't be used anywhere. And neither can the Star, a shower. Nope. Okay, I am a bit lost as to what I should be doing. That's not showing me anything, is it? A shower. A shower. A shower. What do you want from me, game? Deep. Doubt it belonged to a samurai. Star, I doubt it belonged to a samurai. The chest is locked. The house key. Ah. All right. Okay, so now I'm guessing I can dig up whatever I need to dig up. All right. I knew I had to do dig something. I just didn't know where. This is the place marked on the map. I'll use my shower. I've been watching my father and I know his secret access code now. I'm definitely checking what kind of treasures he stores in his safe box. So, blue, purple, green, green.
So now I use the cubes. So blue, purple, green, green. So four, five, two, two. Two, two. There we go. A book. Housemaster's Diary. Okay, so that's what she's doing out in the shed. And... There's a key, a rust key. It might have been used outside the house. Okay. Don't think this is exactly what I should be doing, but all right. Are you Elizabeth or are you Alicia? Definitely not going to regret this. Ah, oh, hell no. She is now gone. Crowbar. Is that a weapon? No. Human skull, okay. So, guessing she's in the box. The chest is locked. The chest is locked, okay. Damn. These are real bones. Take the vinyl disc. Alright. What the hell is that? What is going on? Gonna go inside. Okay, good. Um, there is no record. Here. All right, here we go. Why is this a good idea? You a fool, Henry. Uh, so that's how I wake up here? So we're back in the old version of the house. We need to hide again. Ooh, Jack in the Box. It. It what? It what? Let me close the door. Oh. oh. Oh, I can't close the door now. Children's toy, it's unlikely to scare anyone. Okay. Bye. Alright. Just going to... What's in this side? The side of this one. Nothing. Okay. Oh, 
background. Well, I'm going to leave this one here. Uh, um, not too bad. I got a little bit stumped by the whole shovel thing. I I didn't realize the uh, chest in the kids room needed the, the little shuriken star. Uh, so I was probably stuck at that way more than I needed to be for a lot longer than I needed to be. Um, yeah, not bad. Uh, it's one of the first, uh, like, well, it's the first horror game I've, like, indie horror game I've played on the computer in a very long time. Um, so, trying to get used to the way these games work is is a little bit of a learning curve again. Um, the whole ride and run hide and run mechanic and uh, the little puzzles. Like, I got most of them fairly well. I, I was just that shovel one, really. I wasn't really paying attention. Uh, so that's on me. So, yeah, not too bad so far. Uh, not quite sure how long this is. Uh, it seems to be moving at a bit of a weird pace. I mean, started off with just a kid and then there was a giant thing outside. Um, but we'll pick it up very soon. So if you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like. Uh, Leave a comment letting me know what you thought, uh, any tips, anything like that, or any suggestions for future games, whether they be indie games, horror games, whatever. Uh, be sure to let me know. And if you want to keep up to date with all my content, be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell. All right. Thanks, everyone. Bye.